and gentlemen, here we are at approximately 20,286 feet, going 408 miles per hour in AP-47. Awesome stuff. So the goal today is to see if the P-47 can outdive a K. And, um, I'm only allowed to videotape, not videotape, but record 30 second sections, but I promise you there is no trickery involved. Every time the film runs out, I'm going to be hitting the R button and do another 30 seconds. So, let's see if this beat out dive a K, or at least match a K. And here we go. Going straight. Right down. Almost 90 degrees down. We're at 566. This is max. 566. 6,000. 5,000. 4,000. 3,000. Thirty feet, four forty miles per hour, four twenty, hundred eighty feet, three hundred ninety five, three hundred ninety, three hundred eighty five, three hundred eighty two, three hundred eighty. Three hundred and sixty-nine. So we are now well below the K's maximum uh, speed at this altitude. So five sixty-six, I believe, was the top speed on a dive straight down at two twenty thousand two hundred eighty-six feet. Let's see what the K can do. Okay, so here we are in a BF one hundred nine K, as you can see, and. Um, we're at an altitude of 20,142 feet, going 440 miles per hour. So already the jug has a little under 100 feet altitude advantage. And we're going to start this dive momentarily. So we're going to start the dive here, and let's see how it goes. And here we go straight down and already 550 560 570 70 575 576 at 7000 feet and that's the max 576 pull up 576 so here we go we are 500 feet 14, 407, 390, 385, 384, 382, 377, 376, 375, holding at 5, 385 feet. 371 holding steady. So the K outdove the P47 in a straight dive in fight race. Whether that's realistic or not in real life, I don't care. Because all I was trying to do was prove to Jace that the K is faster in a dive in fight race than the P47. Fan freaking tastic. Suck it. 